Okay, so um, away from the this mic? is still ba- yes. going to be based off of your stats. Still that will tell you how many things. Okay. So I will. This story transcends games. Somebody system. to be. I don't know. I just. You know, be you, gotta, you gotta get crazy. Yeah, no, I, I want the so, story to be that we pulled this piece out like and embedded in a piece of wood is what looks like someone's knuckle. And it closes up in, and it's Sterling's wedding ring embedded in the wood, and it goes to black. <laughs> then well, you just see me go. It'd be crazy. Yeah. And just... <laughs> All right, I'll need um, two people. Duh. It to... makes no sense. I'll need two no people to this. pull a bar from this as they one lift each? one sure. each as they lift the heavy bar. So how this works is you pull and you put it on top. Oh. If you tip the tower over, you're dead. It's, it's one hand. Do you have to like? Put them exactly the way they're supposed to. Can Is you it like one hand only? It? Yeah, one hand only. One, okay. one hand yeah. only. You can never touch a bar with more than one hand or the tower. Oh my goodness. Okay. Man, this has been a roller coaster ride. Yep. Good for the bar. Right. Okay, so you get the bar up and uh, you drop it on the ground stop, with a stop, heavy stop, like, thud. Uh, the door <laughs> swings should open not and beyond the you table. can see yeah. very dirty prison cells. Except and one in one of them, chained against the wall, is a girl who looks quite like Jane over here. <gasps> is that the Does only prisoner? Run? That is the only prisoner who is here. Do they hunt, embrace through the bars? Is it tearful? Um, so, Jenny has been here for a long time. So she can... Bare, she like, she's like encrusted with like probably blood and dirt and stuff, and she's wearing like maybe a shift, but it's so dirty you can't even tell. And she's just sort of like opens her eyes and she, and Jenny's like, Jane's like screaming her name, and she's like, Jane, is, is that is that you? And she's like shaking the bars. Um, it's locked with a electric lock. Um, Unlike the bar, and uh, you gotta find the like, key. Oh, I never thought I'd see you again. All right, touching moment over. So you hear a door open somewhere in the facility. The oh my god! To be exact. Wow, the one is a we have amazingly hearing, so. good boy band hearing. Yeah, because it closes with a thud. Because <laughs> we always wear earplugs. Yeah. Well, point. you'd guess it. Yeah. It would be the the main door. We still perfect all the matter, of course. Does Gabriel's bag of tricks? Eat? That can pry cameras have something that can pry a, a lock. Uh, yes, it does. He's like, uh, the, the yeah, yeah. Hurry, okay, here we go. There's no time for, for all right narrative all at right, this point. Here we go. No, no time. No more narrative. No just, time. Here we go. Actions. How did you pull? Uh, okay, <laughs> Gabe. Gabe. Uh, he, he, gets the the he gets the lock. The GM dies. He's got a couple characters. <laughs> okay, here we Don go. The lock pops open. Too. Um, I don't have to pull at all. The the chains are mostly the like bad there's just like a pin pushed through, keeps her hands so she can't do it herself. Yeah. So you guys are are uh, able able to get the chains off. All right, what have you got? Claim Jenny. These golden chains. These golden chains. Polder, you mean? What like do you guys carrier? do? You yeah. uh carrier. yeah. I reach out my baby. tender child's hand, and grasp hers in a, a wave of. There's no, you can't, we can't use our cute now anymore, Dan. Un, un, okay, unwavering so, kindness. Yeah. Uh, so you heard that because the building sort of shuddered. Um, and uh, yeah, you guys are, you guys know somebody or something has entered the building. You are all sitting in the pens. Um, you could go back to the where where you were. The the killing floor, if you remember had at least one other door out of it, but it also had a door that led to the coolers. Now, the coolers are just a temporary chilling area, so there's yeah. something usually beyond it. Like, you'll go sure. through some fridges, also, and then it'll bring you to another area. Don't all giant office buildings have, like, these exit signs that are specifically designed yes. for emergency exits? It's like, yeah. oh, this way, this, this, yeah, we should follow they those. They do. Um, everywhere you would expect there to be an emergency <laughs> door that leads to the outside. But something came in the entrance and not came in. seen it so far. Hmm. There's only one way out. You see a single exit sign. All right, let's go through that refrigeration room. Maybe that yeah. is still like, shipping and receiving or something. Oh, yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Okay. I thought we came okay. Right. Who's carrying her? We came into well, the We haven't seen shipping yet. The, the... Are you, you're carrying her? Je- Jenny is, uh, yeah, yeah she's, we she's too weak oh, okay. to walk. One okay. of you who is strong okay. must claim her. I'm not strong. It's, uh, I have, I have okay. it's, 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 it's cool. two blocks to lift her. You can split that with somebody or you can, can do it yourself. 
I'll lift her. You got it. Right. Two Tom. blocks, John. Mm-hmm. Johnny, here we go. Oh, it's such responsibility. Johnny, two blocks. Oh, uh, it's two blocks. Golden blocks. Oh, is one for Dan, or are you just carrying her by yourself? I don't remember. One hand at a time. <laughs> it's only one hand at a time. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. She just likes to hold both there for some reason. It's like, you, it's like when you play Sometimes tennis, you do this with yeah. one hand and you smack it. There's a psychological... Yeah. yeah. Gives yeah. you that feeling of Back. control. <laughs> Based on. <laughs> Quack! <laughs> <laughs> do you call us in the middle of things? Is that, that's, that's the text message noise when you call us. It goes... <laughs> ah, <"Aah>, fuck! <laughs> Is Donnie's cousin the penguin on a different world? <laughs> oh, this is so shaky. Already, yeah. We've talked already about the accidental hidden message in his name. <laughs> Don Mallard? Don the Mallard. Don. <laughs> Don't give it away, it's a puzzle! Is it though? It was an accident. It's not really a puzzle. It was an accident. It's like a All right! Time. Ooh, baby. Ooh, he, 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 okay, Woo. so uh, you manage to Way get her to, to her feet, thought. and you're supporting most of her weight. She's barely able to walk, and as you you hustle through, who who's um, Thomas is at the front. He is uh, he pushes open the the door. He's like, "We're going this way, okay, through the, through the chillers. F- follow close. Nobody gets left behind. Come on, let's go." He uh, pulls open a door. Uh, Gabe's like, "Okay, okay, here." Somebody filming this? I mean, this is so much. This is, uh, and he runs ahead and opens the next door. So, you, yeah, there's getting, another getting, cooler. Getting yeah, we're getting pictures. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There's like, you now you can see it's definitely not Blast rust there. Media. It's definitely yeah. not yeah. rust. Yeah. Um, you're you're in the cooler. Uh, it looks like things have been pulled across the floor. There's these these various smears and stuff. Um. You enter through another cooler, and then you're out again. And in this area, there are you are now in in sort of a, a mixing area. There's a lot of long metal tables um, with like some some shipping crates on them, and uh, yeah, nothing. Just packing packaging materials and things. And um, there's a another body sprawled on the floor this time, sort of like this. Also, if you uh, down also on the side. Um, they look human. Um, Do back these of their humans look like they work here, like they're in uniforms and stuff? Yeah, yeah. Okay. They, they're they're wearing like a like a food fresh. Uh, interesting. Yeah, they got okay. the backs and of their heads. The backs of their heads are full of crystals. Cracked, full of crystals. Yes. Uh. Hmm. They are controlled. Okay. Crystals. Okay. Here's um, a question. That no 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 mo whatever it was mass that we saw was that in perfect world or was that in that was in perfect world? world. That was yeah. in perfect world. It was like a thing. I'm gonna to turn overlay. mine back on Regal. I guess I can't like quickly do that, can I? Uh, it takes, it takes five, five minutes. minutes. Uh, All right. I guess I'm committed to not having it on. Okay. So, um you could if you want. You've been slamming some doors. Like, you will be out of here though. At one point somebody could swear they heard footsteps. Um you guys there are three doors. One looks like it's to a storage area. You can think you think that you're like maybe have circled around you're like back there's a door that you think mm-hmm. might lead back to that open retail area there's also um a be- another door and this one has a um this 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 one has an exit sign there's an exit sign in this room and it's pointing towards a door that leads to the back of this facility here so we go that direction. it's hard to resist instinct no. okay <laughs> if it says exit yeah let's go there okay so um you break through the doors. Uh, you're now in a smoking room, um, and you you can you can definitely is it this or no, beef no, jerky like, smoking? Like beef beef oh, okay. smoking. There are a lot of these double meetings. There are rooms. these large like cabinets that are closed, and uh, these ones you almost meat. killed us all. It was nice. Stop fidgeting. Until, until the pans off. There is there is <laughs> meat, and it's hanging from hooks in these uh, containers. Um, has anyone <laughs> of you seen pork before, perhaps? Uh, I'm we sure Ian has, has yeah, seen uh, dead animals before. Um, you know, it looks kind of like a, a pig carcass, but you know it's not. There's just something about 
I mean, there's no head and there's no hands or feet, but something about the splay of the ribs, the uh, the color of the meat, makes you recognize that it it it's clearly uh, a thoughts uh, in your head that are quite dark. Long yeah. pork. Yeah. yeah, Gabe. Gabe has like a camera now, and he's he's taking pictures as well. And he's like, "Why wasn't I taking pictures earlier?" Oh, this is this is this is the important part. This is what I was telling you. Footsteps. Okay. Um, exit door. That looks like it goes outside. Let's. Shall we? Yeah. Yes, we'll go that way. We're sprinting Did you through say this room. Footsteps singular. Sounded like p plural to me. It okay. sounded like there were. Because I was thinking uh, in singular, three of you have guns. Um, yeah, we're still running though. As yeah. he says this, the the door to the cooler, or let's see, you guys, oh, you guys are in the smoking room, so yeah, uh, you hear the Your sound of the like table. that large fridge Hello? door that you I guys pass it. through, uh, slam shut. You're still bouncing oh. the floor. And there's the some, the there is a pair of footsteps that are um, rapidly approaching through the uh, mixing and stuffing area. You can hear like. A table get pushed over, metal upon the floor, it, like, rings out. Um, I ready my phone camera, and I duck in between the two gun people. I ready my okay. gun. I mean, there's an exit behind you. Yeah, I'm guessing Gabe's going <laughs> We go, the but, like, <laughs> yeah. we are yeah. still okay. that. I figure Gabe had already gone I have a Thomas is, like, I have a person Thomas is on looking me. back. I'm He's not going to sit around and wait for gunfire. I'm there. Yeah. I have a person yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm saving. All right, so okay. Johnny is out the door first. Okay, Johnny's out the door first. Uh, Thomas is actually standing next, to, in between you and the door where the footsteps are coming from. He's covering us. Yeah, yeah, he's right. covering him. Jane, Jane uh, jo is with us, right? Yes, yeah. Okay, Jane, I, Jane's grab, with her, you I grab her arm and take her out. And Jane, Jane has been, like, following right behind yeah. you yeah, and okay. Jenny the whole cool. time just right. to make sure she's so okay. She's sort of, like, supporting her from the other side. Um, all right. The door swings. You push the door open, and it's the guy in the suit, the dark suit and he's standing there in front of the exit he, he's outside and he's he's and he he's looking right at you the man in the suit the man in the suit the, man, have, the same man the gun, that right? uh several of you have seen earlier um when you had your perfect oh, yeah. world turned off oh, he yeah. recognizes the man in the suit i pull he's my gun the same him. man all right what the what, what are you what doing what's going on he says put that down there won't be any need for violence if you come with us. <laughs> Gabe's like, <laughs> shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. I Somebody pull a block. I'll shoot him. Okay. Pull a block. Okay. Oh, geez. Pull a block, fire a Glock. Pull a block, fire a Glock. All right. That was close. It was a tippy tower. Top, top yeah. watch and the tippy table drop. Oh, yeah. At first, I That's was gonna be challenge. like, Oh, pull five blocks because we don't have much time to do this. Yeah. But this table is making this very interesting with yeah. just one block. Okay, um, boom, you fire. Where are you aiming? Right at his chest, <laughs> right at his chest. Okay, um, the bullets hit him, and instead of making oh. a meaty thunk like you'd expect there's a ringing sound like metal hitting metal the bullet skids off uh he Maybe staggers he backwards mm -hmm. um yeah i shoot him I he, he looks at you you shouldn't have done that <laughs> he says uh the doors behind like... you <laughs> full auto <laughs> that go back to the mixing room are thrown open it's the, the woman in the red though. dress and the um High schooler, it looks like, with the backpack. And they ah. both have the same looks as they step forward. Those aren't cops. They're like, there's nowhere to go. What do you feel from them, Just Ian? put down your guns. Uh, gu Thomas, Thomas, Thomas takes a shot. Hey, Thomas, Ooh. take care. Oh, aim before you shoot. Don't shoot before you aim. Right. Okay. Uh, Thomas shoots the... Well, he can't... Oh, it's such a tough choice for him. His his gun wavers a bit between the two, and then he Path of shoots resistance. the woman. Oh, good. Uh, he he aims yeah, for yeah. the head, and the bullet, Mike, goes through the eye, and she staggers back. There's like a bunch of sparks that like shoot out, oh my and God. then, then she robots. falls down on the ground. Um, 
The kid sprints towards him after this, this kind of quick, and then grabs him and starts to grapple with him. Okay, so, uh, first thing. Those two with their brains blown out with crystals inside, did we get a sense that, like, something had appropriated their bodies and had escaped out from, like, do, do I have any sense that there's organic intelligence involved? Um, something blow it doesn't look like it was it looked like it was ripped from okay the so outside. not something from the inside blowing up no it was it was uh yeah so the other thing up. is that these these machine bodies do they mm -hmm. look like they could like when they, the shot went through the brain and the, the woman dropped uh-huh does it look like it's just machine or is there any indication that there's organic material involved um you can see something shimmer through the hole but that's it okay yeah yeah, it's a little hard to see right now sure. because uh All right, so, gunfire. Yeah. So, Thomas is being grappled by Backpack Kid. You're yep. you're I'm opening it up on Suit Guy. Man. I don't know. So Suit Guy is the actual only person staying between us and Freedom, right? Yes. yes. So that's I keep the one we're focusing on. Okay. I try and shoot him in the head this time. Well uh, let me to help distract him. Okay. Ooh. I'm gonna use my sexy powers to rip off my shirt and throw it on him and cover. He won't be able to see. It. All right, pull block. That's a boy. That's the real boy band way of doing it. They never anticipated that. <laughs> They're using the boy band powers against us. Which one do I want? Do you want to take it from the other side? I'm just testing pieces. Hello from the other side. There you go. I don't want that one though. It's not a boy band, never mind. No. No, that's a woman. That's, that's a gel. Losing it. That's it. Oh. Perfect. Oh my god. Nicely wow. That's good. All right. James, you got to use your flick technique to just drop the tower down a level. I know, right? <laughs> the shirt it whips yeah, out <laughs> around his neck, and you know it seems. It kind of blocks his vision as yeah, you do it. Yeah, it. yeah. So he he is staggered back. I won't make Philip pull a tile because of uh, this distraction. Thank you, uh, Philip. You're able to shoot it, shoot him Boom. in the head. <laughs> Boom. Um, the same shower of, of of sparks, and then it. What's they don't they don't make any it's noise as you highlight. shoot them, um, or as they they're shot. Scream or anything. Yeah, they don't scream or anything. It's just the sound they of just, being hit. Yeah, yeah. It falls. Oh, no. Falls and he, then he falls backwards onto the ground. Um, Th Thomas shouts. He goes, "Go, just go." We go. Yeah. We go. He we is, go. He's wrestling. All right. So Gabe, Gabe's Wait. been like snapping photos. So does it look then... like Thomas is going to be killed by this thing? Is it clear he's losing? Yeah. All he's right. Being overpowered. So, so they may not remember, but there is one more power that my uh, race has, <laughs> and that's like crazy high pitched singing. They're yes. electronics. They can oh. be disrupted by sound. So I'm going to uh, black bulk this guy. Do we guy. need to cover our ears? <clears throat> cover your ears. Uh, there's I'm no gonna, time. I'm gonna, there's no time. You have to run. I'm going to focus on saving Thomas. I felt one near the top that was pretty loose. Yeah, like this it might one, be this one, right? one. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Nice. But the Holy rest. Shit. The question Not is, can it take one more weight on that side? There we go. Oh. All right. Yeah, I'm going to try right. to blast backpack kid to save Thomas. Okay. Um, is it? It's it's high pitched. Yeah, okay. I'm literally going to come up yeah. and join the grapple and press my mouth against the head of this okay. thing. Okay. So everybody is just like, there's this. I don't know. Describe it for us, James. I cannot Here. do it because okay. it's like it's, it's it is ultrasonic. Just ultrasonic. Like ultrasonic break your sound? eardrums, even when you're not directly in front Give of it, and when you're in front of it, even worse. Um, <laughs> So you see this? Just like is it automatic? It, like, its yeah. eyes like widen, and then you hear like a strange popping sound. There's like a sounds like somebody's taking a car window and then smashing it on the ground nice. multiple multiple times, and then the boy's grasp <laughs> loosens and then it, it falls back and like excellent. Just so we can't hear anything now. Can Thomas run? Yes, Th okay? Thomas can run. Okay. He like staggers off and he goes. Or his, his ears are probably like bleeding. Right? We all have yeah, like yeah, his, we all, we all he's got like, like, like a little trickle, oh, little trickle, but he's like, I, no. I told oh, you, he's like not here. No. <laughs> uh, we we got to get out of here. I don't know. I don't know how many more of those there are. We got to run. Yeah, well, we've been running. Okay, we run. You run. We run. Um, as you run, there you see. Off in the distance, you see a f 
a figure. You see somebody, um, right. and they just like wave at you because nobody it. has perfect world. You Dumb. can't tell yeah. if this is a spooky person <coughs> or not. But they just like wave and smile, and then they point in a direction. What can that be? What, what's up there, there is an alleyway. It's not the same way you came, but. Um, yeah, you figure it might lead back around. All right, I'm gonna follow. Yeah, let's, yeah, let's do that. Well, sure, why not? Do okay. I? Yeah, because we know this either is a... certain death or freedom. Um, we we flip yeah, a coin. This is not can the you one not... that's chasing them. What? Can it's you? Fine. Can you? This is fine. <laughs> so like, if I, doing if I could, would I give them a call? Um, right as you are about to run, you hear a strange like do, 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 you hear do, 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 a pop, do, 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 do. like. Hmm, gas escaping from something <laughs> and a hissing sound. Ooh. Oh my gosh, that's gonna explode. And then a strange vibration in the air. Ooh, is food fresh in clothing? Um, <gasps> is, is it door? rising? Uh, the, the, the ground and flying off into space? Uh, no. The figure who is who was waving and pointing. Yep. Something like gets a uh oh look on their face, mm -hmm. then turns towards the door and sprints. Towards the door you guys just came out of. Oh. So you guys are running and right. you're heading towards that alleyway. Right. They run past you. They run with a strange gait, uh, very similar to uh, the things you've seen before. Ooh. And Robots. then you see like a flash of of <laughs> light that? reflected off crystal, and then some something sinuous and green like float a little bit out of the door. And then the running figure hits it and then tackles it back into the door. Ooh. And then you're gone. You're, you're through the alleyway and you're running. What is oh, wow. The game's like, I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going. Okay. Were those, were those lizard people? I don't know. They they didn't have ro robots. They're... Something. You were close. Green. I don't it's know. Not quite lizard people. I, I, I don't know anything. Something's obviously wrong. Disappearances, I told you. Okay. It's, but the meat, you saw the meat. And we all saw the meat. Yeah. Um, but I don't know what, what they actually are. Uh What's Charlotte, just... we have to get into contact oh, with Charlotte. Sweet. It's it's the only the only way. I think now that the adrenaline is wearing off, Micah's <laughs> gonna sit down on the ground and cry. Okay. Alright. Okay. Let's cut back to Richie. Boy, while all of this was happening, Richie yeah, had run out the door. No. He's running. And he runs towards an alleyway. He's running and he's running. Pull. Twice from the tower for me, Richie. Twice. Oh. This is it. Here, let's get out of his way. Here so comes that, Will. Uh, Richie can be main can, camera comes, and also... Here comes he's Richie. behind the camera the whole time. He's, got, he's gonna do his pulls. Wait, wait, let me, let me get this on the auxiliary cam. Really? Yeah. <laughs> The James Ham. Yes. How many pulls am I making? Two, 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 two pulls. Two pulls. It's already been, it's already been made to be impossible. Oh, I forgot about that one. He's going for it, folks. Where is oh, it? Oh wait, there's oh, one. More. There's a freebie down there. there. We got one. Oh, there's a freebie. Oh uh, yes, there's a uh, freebie. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Like he did it. Well, that's just two to start. He gets away. Oh oh oh! oh, oh. Okay, as he throws oh. it. Oh. 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 <laughs> All righty. All right. Uh, Richie, do you have your perfect world on or not? You know, I've been running. I've not had a chance to turn it back on, unfortunately. Okay, so as you duck, as you run into this alley, um, a dark shape's on the ground. Uh, you manage to vault over it instead of tripping. Uh, do you stop to check it out? Wait, say that one more time? There, You are running. You run into a dark alley. Something... Uh, Crumpled form on the ground uh, almost trips you up, but you're able to vault over it. Do you keep running or do you stop? I keep running. Okay. You keep running. Um, as you pass it, you hear a hissing in the air. There's uh, the like a vibration, like soft thunder in the distance. Uh, pull again for me. <laughs> All gotcha. right. You so, really half dead though. You feel something against your cheek. That's the the, the first thing you feel. Um, okay. And then all, all it it just feels like like a feather brushing, and then <coughs> then the pain sets in. You're bleeding. Um, you reach oh, up to your, touch yeah, your cheek, and there's blood, and it's a cut. You don't know how deep. 
Um, you're you're still running. Uh, you dart your head back towards the vibration. Wait, wait. So if I feel that, I'm gonna pull out my phone to start live recording. Okay. Myself. Okay. But, oh, but you're not connected to the perfect. Moment. But you're not connected to the perfect world. <laughs> Death He's got specialty <laughs> camera equipment. He has a yeah. specialty camera okay, equipment. Okay, okay. You're live streaming. What do you say, Richie? Look, I'm, I'm, no, I'm just running. Now. Okay, you're running. <laughs> but I, um, I pulled it out. You angle the camera over. Are you, are you looking through the camera or are you looking through... Are you found footaging it? I have the camera with the viewfinder flipped to face so I can okay. see. All right. Yes. You're running away. You're using... You're, the camera's pointing back over your shoulder. There is something in the air, but you can't tell what it is. There's a green, but it's obscured by a, a filter. Something is blurring it. It's uh, sinuous, and then there are these other things, and they're there's like the they reflect the light. They're crystalline. There's like six of them, and they're hovering in the air. And as as you're GG. you're watching, one of them darts forward, and then you feel something in your stomach, and you look down, and there's blood. There's more blood than you've ever seen, and then you're on. So you feel something and it's it's rough against your cheek and then it's warm and then you're cold and then nothing. Oh, it's cold up here. Oh, I love it. Spooky. And then okay. the camera just keeps I mean, I probably keeps, I probably fall to the ground and yeah. it just keeps just cycling. And then yeah. just the two people having a good time on the The camera <laughs> the live stream shows this thing and it it sort of comes out of the air and it gets closer. You can see that it's sort of rope like. Yeah. Um, and it's 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 uh, humming. And then as it it approaches you, it approaches your slumped over form, and then it like dips down. And then and suddenly it's the sound like like wet paper towels being ripped Ew. and torn. And then and then there's some splatter on the camera. Whoosh. <laughs> And then to shreds, you say. Yeah. Hello, darkness, my old friend. Is All right. Oh. Epilogue. <laughs> Richie's live stream never made it out into the greater world, but there were some who watched at his final moments and knew that some something was coming, but they, they knew that they needed to to take action. Now, the rest of the, the new harmonics, um, Gabe convinced them that it was not in their best interest to go back after what they had seen, that they'd be taken out. Now, did anyone not take his advice and head back? Okay, so, JP have... Augustine. Oh, to Don Mallard? Yeah. Yep. That's just you. Uh, Gabe offered to Safe House and said they, they could hide out in um, they were in it together, so they could go. They could go to his house and. Oh, uh, I immediately follow his his him, new house. You know. um, they could figure out what was what to do next from there. Maybe change their names, change their faces, get off world. Who knows? Um, J.P. Augustine and only J.P. Augustine went back. Yeah. Um, he was greeted not by Don Mallard, but rather by a um, bunch of bodyguards. You never met them before, but they looked more like security agents. And he was brought to the presence of Don Mallard and um, and Mr. Stewart himself. Mr. Charles Stewart, the president of Big E Entertainment. Whoa, uh-oh. He's gonna eat Where he you. was told that the things that he saw were unimportant and uh, fabrications and that there were high hopes for his, his future. You got a solo career in the works, kid. All, all he had to do was... <laughs> it was uh, a bunch of nonsense. You were distracted. his head down, his nose to the grindstone, yeah. and... Anything was possible, even the curing of the moon sickness that his mother yeah. had faced. In fact, an advanced form of recognition is the moon sickness. Now, it's no longer possible to compete in the competition in the Muse Idol, but he would have financing for the next group. And Don, Don had done a good job. Yes! He had done a good job with what he'd had. It was very unfortunate in the end that... 
that uh, choices had been taken out of his hands. So he would be put in charge of J.B. Augustine's uh, future uh, band career and, and maybe next year do something better. And this time it would be centered around me from the get-go. Yes. Now, um... You can call it J.P. and the Augustines. About a year passes. Um, Gabe and the, the rest find ways to get off planet. Uh, J.P. Augustine, his solo career is in full swing. Um, the couple of boy bands that he was partnered with uh, fell out of favor, but boosted him enough that he, his name was a household one. Nice. Um, and it was right at the height of his and Don's uh, career that the war broke out because uh, it turned out that uh, Gabe had been right. There was <laughs> secrets within. He just wasn't quite correct. The wasn't reptilians, rather it was a, a race of uh, ancient creatures called the Quetzal. And they had oh, uh, that's cool. infiltrated much as Gabe had uh, predicted or discovered into the perfect world. And they were hiding within these android, these robotic bodies. Mm. Now, the cheaper ones were obviously not human, but the most expensive, such as that of Mr. Stewart himself, were perfect. It was only when Charlotte, also known as Mary Stewart, the daughter of Charles Stewart, mm. uh, brought her rebellion to its head and started attacking innocence and managed to get it broadcasted out into the outer galaxy that uh, war between the Quetzal and the humans broke out instead of the rest of the Quetzal which which uh, were Charles was a big member of big important member of who wanted to keep it under wraps and just eat as uh, under under secret conditions and that is where we 